I'm Jerry Reynolds, The Car Pro, and welcome to another edition of The Automotive News in Two Minutes. They're big and heavy, and with improvements to stability control, SUVs do a great job of keeping drivers and passengers safe. But what about the cars they collide with? Well, it used to be high-profile vehicles did a number on smaller vehicles, but automakers have lowered the bumpers on SUVs to match smaller cars. And of course, they've added more safety features to the small cars to protect the people inside them. The result? Fatalities from SUV crashes have dropped 64% over the past decade. Now, speaking of small cars, the Beetle has a special place in my heart, so I was very interested to see how this new one stacked up to the car's legacy. The first car I ever drove was the Volkswagen Beetle, so I was really excited to have this 2012 completely redesigned one that is actually wider and longer and less tall than previous editions. Also gone to give it a better look is that circle roof that you were so used to with the Beetle. That's gone. It's now flat. So you can have this panoramic moonroof that this one's got. Under the hood, up front, not a rear engine anymore, 2.5 liter, 5 cylinder, putting out 170 horses with a 6 speed automatic. The car drives great. The suspension is super and it is very, very quiet. A lot of nice changes to the interior too. If you look around, you'll see ambient lighting, this navigation system, a fender stereo system, push button start, and every Volkswagen comes with Bluetooth. This new model is geared more to everyone instead of just the female buyer. It's got a more aggressive look for the men. In 73 years, the Beetle has maintained its heritage. This car is not a disappointment in any way, but it is for sure the best driving Beetle ever. 23 in the city, 32 out on the highway, 25.2 is the MSRP of this car, the way this one is equipped. And I'll tell you this, the heritage in this car is not gone, but thank goodness the flower vase is. Here's something interesting. VW sold 21 and a half million of the original Beetle, making it the most popular car built off a single platform. Now Volkswagen is hoping the new Beetle will help the company turn a profit in the United States for the first time since 2003. Catch me on the radio Saturday in Dallas-Fort Worth, Houston, San Antonio, Austin, Los Angeles, Sacramento, Lubbock, and Phoenix. Check the website, carproshow.com, for showtimes and details. I'm Jerry the Car Pro. Have a great week.